guys, welcome back to the channel. Just uploaded, uploaded the Kofi Kingston, Daniel Bryan, WrestleMania 35 promo package. Now we're going to get to the AJ Styles versus Randy Orton, which is the match I'm looking for the most this entire weekend, even more than the main event. AJ versus Randy Orton really could main event the show. This is what these two men having a match represents what WrestleMania is all about. Putting two great competitors against each other. Why have we lost that? Why have we lost that in WrestleMania? Like, you go through some of the best WrestleMania matches that are not for titles. For example, Michaels Jericho, 19. Michaels Taker, 25. Michaels Taker, 26. Um, let's keep going down the line of lists. Taker, Triple H, uh, 17. Uh, 27. 28. Um, what else do you guys want me to get? name out here for you guys? Angle Michaels, WrestleMania, 21. Um... Let's see. I'm trying to think about any more manias that had some good matches. 24, 24, 24. 24, Ric Flair and Shawn Michaels. Um, 26. What was that, 26? Damn, 26 was a bad show. 20, besides Taker and Michaels at 26, I'm um, trying to think about recent manias for you guys. Um, damn, you really can't, man, because there's not really that been that many great recent one-on-one -on -one matches, but not for belts. Um, Taker versus Punk, 29. Just a name a list of matches right there that when you put together two guys are not for the belts that mean something. AJ versus Randy Orton literally is what Mania has been built on the past decades. Two guys who are great going at each other for no belts. Like, Mania should always be about putting the best matches you can forward. Now, there are a couple of matches on this card where you're like, okay, Roman Reigns versus Drew McIntyre. Okay, AJ versus Randy. And about after that, I mean, you know what I'm saying? About after that. But let's get to this fan-made AJ versus Randy Orton promo. I have heard all your theories as to why I did what I did. You people want to know why I did what I did? Look in the mirror. I did it because of you. All of you have made your choice. And so have I. And that means that I will erase every superstar that you choose to believe in. Again, this is one thing that I mean, can still do better than any company. Their promo packages are fucking fire. I will become so violent that you will... Ah, Jeff Hardy screaming because he's on the fucking pre-show WrestleMania. And I will erase every superstar that you people respect. Which is another reason why I'm doing what I'm doing. I don't get the respect that I deserve from you. I don't get the respect that I deserve from everyone in the back. I'm going to WrestleMania. This is a dream match. We wanted it. I want to give it to you. I'm no different than you. I'm just like the WWE Universe. In fact, if you want to call me the everyman, I'm okay with that. That's until I step in this ring. When I step through these ropes and I stand right here in front of you, I am phenomenal. When I started my career here, so far, I was so the good. youngest man in that locker room. I went on to become the Lord youngest the world heavyweight champion ever. I've won the world title 13 times. I have main evented WrestleMania, Royal Rumble, Money in the Bank, Survivor Series. All of them. I have won them all on multiple occasions, but you still Boo don't me. respect me. When you get in the ring with me, you've now entered mm. the world of a Jay Styles. You see this right here? This is my home. This is what I do. And in this ring between these ropes, I am untouchable. But the fact still remains the same. You mm. have never beaten me. Nope. AJ has never beaten me. That's true. I am going to prove that you are no more than a father. And you're not going to beat me this Sunday. But if you want to redeem yourself for what you didn't do last week, well, then all I got to say is do something about it. AJ Styles is a winner. I am the elite. I am the greatest. I am the phenomenal AJ Styles. I am going to beat the hell out of you. Mm. I am all around the best performer to ever step foot in a WWE ring. Mm. At WrestleMania, you're going to find out how... Yeah, that RKO still really made stuff wrong. Apex Predator, 
Pfeiffer. You can even call me the legend killer. The only thing you need to refer to me as is the three most destructive letters in sports entertainment, and that is R K O. Shit, man. <laughs> that was yo. That was kind of hot, man. That was kind of fire. Again, this is the match I'm looking for the most out of the whole weekend. AJ versus Randy Orton. Well, not the whole weekend, but as far as WrestleMania. Adam Cole versus Gargano. And Matt Riddle versus um, Velveteen Dream. Those are probably my three most matches I'm looking for the whole weekend. But, dude. They gave away the RKO off the springboard. I mean, they gave, they gave away the phenomenal forearm into the RKO. Like, there's only one more move they can do. If he can fucking do a 450 into an RKO, holy shit. Holy shit, people, holy shit. That's giving me goosebumps right now. But forget to like the video, comment down below, subscribe again. My predictions for WrestleMania are been on the channel since Wednesday. And also for TakeOver on New York, which is tonight, those predictions are on the channel. So I'll be getting home a little bit late. I'll probably be going live around 9.20 or 9.30. Hopefully we don't miss Bubble Team Dream versus Matt Riddle. So looking for that shit too. But catch you guys later here tonight. Forget to like, comment, subscribe. Follow the Twitter, Instagram, Snapchat are all down below for you guys to follow. Catch you guys later tonight for NXT TakeOver in New York. Live reactions. Oh,